Hi, my name is Lee Williamson. Subscribe to Reggae Boys Commentary. Hi, my name is Joby McEnough. Subscribe to Reggae Boys Commentary. Skin clean and nice and ting and ting. I'm Tiffany Cannon. <laughs> I'm Tiffany Cannon, Reggae Girl Striker, and you are watching the Reggae Boys Commentary. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hello everyone, my name is Simon Bolivar. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Simon Preston. And welcome to Reggae Boys Commentary. Thank you so much for tuning in to another video on this channel. Really, really appreciate it. So, let's go right into the mix of things where we can talk a little bit about a player that we discussed roughly 18 months ago. This man was 21 at the time when we spoke about him. And now he is an individual that is looking for solid ground. Who are we referring to? Well, we are referring to none other than Fabio Nicholas Dixon. Who is Fabio Nicholas Dixon? Well, Fabio Nicholas Dixon is a 23-year-old right back who was born in Zurich, Switzerland. He was born to a Jamaican father and to a Swiss mother. So his paternal side of the family is Jamaican. Fabio began his career in the youth academy of FC Zurich. And he spent close to a decade in the academy of FC Zurich. He was highly rated within the academy. However, it was always looked upon that it would be difficult for him to break into the first team. Eventually, though, his opportunity game came in 2018, and he made three appearances in the first team for Zurich in the 2018-2019 season. Shortly after that, he moved. He moved to FC Chiasso. And FC Chiasso are a club that operates in the Swiss Promotion League. Now, this is essentially the third tier of Swiss football. The Swiss Challenge League is a second tier, while the Super League, the Swiss Super League, is the top tier of Swiss football. Of course, FC Zurich have won it 13 times and they're the current defending champions, but Grasshopper is the most successful team in the history of the, the competition as they've won the title 27 times. So that's a bit of history as it relates to Swiss football and their operation. Now, he made a move again because he only spent two seasons at Chiasso. The 2021-2022 season, he spent with AC Belizona, which is also located in the Challenge League. And the Challenge League is the, the second tier. So he moved up by a league. And right now, as we speak, he joined a club earlier this year called... Dulkirk FF. Now, Dulkirk FF operate in the Super Retan, and that is the second tier of Swedish football. So they have a bit of a journey to go to be able to climb for promotion. Why do I say that? Well, let me show you why. Basically, it's down to where they stand within the table at this point in time. The club right now are 15th in the table. They're on 18 points and they're two points adrift of safety.
Granted, the teams that are 13th and 14th, they're only a point off. And the teams 12th and 11th are just a point off. So a win, and you can find yourself back into safety. So it's all about dull curd FF being able to, for the rest of the season, which is another 11 games, be able to garner six wins. Six wins, and they'll be able to accomplish that. So now that we were able to accomplish that, what is the deal with Fabio Dixon? Well, as previously mentioned a year ago, Fabio Nicholas Dixon has declared an interest to play for Jamaica. And the latest is that Fabio Dixon has received his Jamaican citizenship. Fabio is a step closer to representing Jamaica. As you know, before you can get a passport, you need a citizenship. And once that citizenship is accomplished, the passport comes quite naturally after. So Fabio Dixon is halfway through the process of being able to say he is a reggae boy or he has a Jamaican passport. Of course, the passports will be needed as it is a travel document, but the citizenship is basically that key prerequisite that helps everything, and I mean absolutely everything, to fall into place smoothly. So that is the latest as it relates to Fabio Dixon. And I know some of you might be saying to yourselves, well, who is this Fabio Dixon? How does he look like? Because some people might not remember how he does look like. Well, that's Fabio Dixon right there. That's Fabio Dixon. Mm -hmm. And I'll show you another picture that looks like Fabio. And this guy right here looks like Fabio too. And that's Fabio. So that's Fabio Dixon. So, Reggae Boys fans, what are your thoughts? How do you feel about the situation with Fabio Dixon? Is this something that you're happy about? Are you delighted that this is an individual that has completed the citizenship process before he can get a Jamaican passport? What are your thoughts? Are you happy about it? Does this bring you with excitement? A player who can operate as a right back, who is a right back, and it's an area that you know we have plenty of options to call upon in terms of eligibility. You still have players that don't have Jamaican passports or right backs, but my point is that it is an area where you're always going to need depth in. And this is one step down. So, Reggae Boys fans, what are your thoughts? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to Reggae Boys Commentary.